Hello, this is Rohit, and we will be solving the problem in counting words. Its difficulty level is K4, and it requires operation. It appeared in Status 46. Harsh was recently gifted a book consisting of n pages, and each page contains exactly m words printed on it. And as he was bored, he decided to count the number of words in the book. So our task is to help Harsh find the total number of words in the book. Coming to our input, the first line will contain a single integer t, which is the number of test cases. And then for each test case, we will have two space separated integers on a single line, which is n and m. n is the number of pages and m is the number of words on each page. And for output, we have to print a single integer, which is the total number of words in the book. So now let's have a look at the sample test cases. For the first case, the book has n number of pages, which is 1. So the book has only one page and each page has only one word on it because m is equal to 1. So as there is only one page and there is only one word on a page, the total number of words in this case would be 1. So now for the second test case, the book has 4 pages because n is equal to 4 and there are two words on each page. So that means there are two words on the first page two words on the second page, third page and fourth page and so on. So the total number of words would be 2 multiplied by 4 which is 8. So the answer is 8 in this case. For the third test case, there are 95 pages and each page will have 42 words in it. So the first page will have 42 words. The second page will also have 42 words and so on. And the 95th page will also have 42 words on it. So the total count is 95. So as there are 42 words on each page and there are 95 pages, the total number of words in the book would be the number of pages 95 multiplied by the number of words on each page. The answer in this case is 3990. So let's summarize our algorithm and also write the pseudocode for it. So for each test case, we will have two integers n and m. So we just take the input. And then our answer would be the total number of pages multiplied by the total number of words on each page, which is m. So, uh, so our answer is nothing but n multiplied by m and then we just print our answer. If you are still unable to understand the problem or not able to get the correct answer to your code, then don't worry, you can ask your doubt to our doubt solvers. So what you have to do is, you have to go to the practice problem section and then search for the problem which you are having difficulty in. Let's say the problem code of that problem is DNA storage. So you search for the problem, go to the problem and then under the ask a doubt tab, you can go and ask your doubts and your doubts would be cleared instantly. Let's have a look at the implementation. We take an input t which is the number of test cases. Then we run a loop of length t and for each test case we take our two integers n and m and then we calculate our answer.